Hey, my good friends, Sam Haymart with Test Driven TV. Recently, we had the chance to get the 2021 Ford Ranger into our garage for a full underhood tour to show you what it looks like under there, where all the major service points are, and what are the major components you need to know about. The 2021 Ford Ranger we have here is a 2.3 liter EcoBoost turbocharged four cylinder engine mated to a 10 speed Ford designed and built automatic transmission. And this one's equipped with four wheel drive. It's rated at 270 horsepower and has 310 pound feet of torque. It features an aluminum block and head, dual overhead cams with variable cam timing and direct fuel injection. A twin scroll turbocharger featuring an electronically controlled wastegate is mounted directly to its head, which features an integrated exhaust manifold. Following the airflow, the intake charge starts at a snorkel at the top of the radiator on the passenger side and flows into a large air filter box. From there, it travels directly into the twin scroll turbocharger mounted low on the passenger side of the engine. From there, the air travels down underneath to an air-to-air -air intercooler mounted behind the front bumper and ahead of the main cooling radiator. The air travels then back up to the driver's side of the engine to a drive-by-wire throttle body and into the composite plastic intake manifold. On top of the engine, you can see four spark plug coil packs visible surrounded by the composite plastic valve cover. The majority of the direct fuel injection componentry is hidden underneath, exposed only is the high-pressure fuel regulator at the rear top of the engine. Servicing the Ford Ranger EcoBoost is relatively straightforward. Of note is the fact that there's a conventional engine-mounted cooling fan, so you should never operate and work under the hood with the engine running. The coolant reservoir is located at the passenger side rear of the engine compartment near the firewall. Ahead of it is the air filter box, and just to the front of that is the windshield washer fluid reservoir. Checking the engine oil and filling it is done at the front and center top of the engine. The engine oil filter can be accessed from underneath the truck, and because the 10-speed automatic transmission is a sealed unit not encouraging your servicing and maintenance, there is no dipstick or filler cap for it under the hood. Additionally, there's no power steering fluid reservoir here as the Ranger has electric power steering. Checking and filling the brake fluid is done at the expected location at the driver's side firewall. While the Ranger uses a traditional brake master cylinder and booster, the ABS control unit is located also just to the side of it, another item typically not user serviceable. The 12 volt battery is located just forward of the brake system and the high current fuse box is adjacent to it. Additionally, this truck has the tremor package with the upfitter switches and thus has an extra fuse box located just behind the headlamp on the driver's side. The main low current fuse box for interior and consumer grade circuits can be found on the inside of the cab behind a cover underneath the headlight switch on the driver's side. All right, my friends, there you go for our underhood tour of the 2021 Ford Ranger. Now, we also have another video out there on actually changing that air filter. You can find that link down below. Until then, click right here, see our latest video, or better yet, subscribe to TDTV Garage right there. Either way, stay tuned.